we only test with a shuttle. Japan is uh, tracking head around uh, 25,000 euro or dollar, something like that. So that one can work with this. We shipped maybe four to five system already, but for this version, we need to check one more time for this new version. Anyway, that's why we call hybrid virtual studio, which is unique in the world. Because the both. So right now, for example, this tracking, the movement, when you use a tracking sensor, the tracking sensor movement will make a background change. When you make a PTG or a movement of the tracking camera, that, that will automatically change. But right now, the actor is fixed but all the mixed screen, like a Jimmy Jim movement, all this one from the rendering engine. This is a track sensor list system, which we have patent year 2004. So, uh, go back to this machine. So we, we are trying to make a virtual studio for everybody from everywhere not only in the studio, but also in the classroom, church, any place. So there are many, uh, many advantages we, we emphasize. Sorry, there is still the Korean. So we are trying to make a virtual world in any place. As long as we ha this is a Shodoku tracking sensor we installed in Indonesia. And we can make any chroma virtual environment. So uh, we have uh, three, uh, uh, we have to solve the three uh, biggest problem in virtual studio industry. Everybody ha facing this problem now. The first problem is how we use uh, camera track without sensor or with sensor. So when you see the visual T or ORAD or any other people who is who has a tracking camera based virtual studio. This problem has a very expensive, that's why their system always more than 15, 150,000 US dollar or 200,000 US dollar basically. And not only the price issue, but also difficult to use. They need a setting, they need um, calibrations. So this is a kind of a big bottleneck of virtual studio industry. So we, we make a patent for tracking this in year 2004 and everybody is surprised that we can make a tracking like this way without any tracking sensors, which is mostly uh, enough for many broadcasters. So we, we solve this one uh, using tracking sensor, but of course the tracking this sensor has a limitation because you can, even when I make a big uh, motion like a uh, the uh, now you see the, the uh, my I'm sitting inside of the desk, so we always need uh, some some calibration that the uh, actor has to be slightly moved like this way, and also uh, actor should be slightly rotate and move slightly there to match this way. Anyway, something we need to compensate. This is kind of a visual visual uh, some trick to make this. So with our the method, I mean the we have a actor, vector is blinking now, we select the actor here and then we move XYZ and also rotation XYZ. Without this function, trying this function will not work properly. That's why all the the company like uh, Monaco or uh, other people who is copying our technology. The Monaco was our dealer in year 2007 and 8. And then they understand all our technology and they make a very simple one, but not that level yet. And then VLCast is the dealer of Monaco and they make another copy. So these two people making same technology, trying this. But unfortunately, I have a patent only in Korea. So we are waiting until they come to Korea and then we can grab them. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, they don't have this kind of easy tools, so they have some problem. Anyway, we we have this. That's why they always make a presentation without desk. So if they have a, if they put the desk, they have a huge problem. 
So uh, we solve this problem using the new technology with a tra tracking. And the other one, biggest problem is a 3D graphic design for real-time virtual studio. This is uh, actually a huge problem. Uh, because when, when we solve this problem, we were thinking we can sell a lot. But actually really happening is only several big customers like uh, Italian people, maybe three or four designers really make a set well and also really make um, the programming for Virtual Studio. So the previous time we have a VS4000, which has a script language based Virtual Studio very flexible, very advanced, they can make any menu by themselves. But we find only 1% of our sales, they make uh, the script programming, they make a free use, and they like very much about this function, but uh, very hard to make. So two problems, one is graphic designer, I, I think some misspelling here, graphic design from 3D Max doesn't mean the design for Virtual Studio. So first, they should know 3D Max very well, or Maya very well. Second, they should know studio design technique. Studio design and interior design is different. The, the TV studio has to have big contrast like a red, white, black, and white, red and blue, something like that. What's the sound? Anyway, that... Really? <laughs> 